I'm at work. It is 1237 and we are already done with deliveries for the day. Now I could stay and work until five if I wanted to, but I've been working six days a week for a few weeks now and there's no end in sight. So I talked to my boss and I asked him if it was okay if I took the rest of the day off, I could use the me time. He said yes and I'm so excited. Oh my goodness. I don't know how I just spotted this. Look at right here. Do you guys see this? Do you know what it is? It's a black trumpet. I've never seen these out here. That is so exciting. <laughs> Fantastic. That's just a really pretty red wrestler. I didn't know these were out here. <gasps> There's a bigger one. Look at it. I mean, it's a little old and I don't know that I would eat it, but it's still a black trumpet. I didn't know they were out here. <gasps> Look at them. <gasps> I'm seeing them everywhere now. I'm stepping on them. Oh my goodness, how exciting. Oh, that one's a little mushy. That one's a little mushy. <laughs> I see more. I was just about to turn on the camera and tell you guys that I came out here looking for mushrooms and I wasn't finding any, which is really odd for especially this spot. It's usually a very good producer. And, <laughs> and then I find these. At these guys. I knew at one point what these were, but I don't remember anymore. Another trumpet over there. Can you see it? It's kind of funny because this is the exact spot I normally find. I always call them honey mushrooms, but that is incorrect. They're hedgehog mushrooms, and they have been here for years. When I've come, oh my gosh. Oh, can you see that? I almost ran into that guy. For years when I've come out here looking for them, they've been here for me. So I was disappointed that they weren't here. <laughs> but then something even better turns up in its place. God likes to work that way. Got a few things here. Those are pretty. Down there. Check out the bugs munching on this one. And then these guys, none of that compares to this. Hi, pretty lizard. Hi. Okay, so somehow I have misplaced my, ah. No, I'm all in that. I'm all in that. Ugh. My chicken of the woods tree. I have, every time I've come out here, I've been able to, been able to walk right out to it. But, I can't find it this time. There are so many giant spiders out here today. I need a flamethrower. Anybody got one of those? What is this? It's squishy like a mushroom. Yeah, somehow I've got myself completely lost. Not lost like I don't know how to find my way out of the woods lost, but lost like my normal spots are not <laughs> where they normally are. Uh, there is a lot of like fungal activity and stuff out here just Not my normal mushrooms, but I'm still I mean this this right here is worth it all by itself Well, I just got the call that Ricky is ready To be picked up so I didn't get to find my chicken of the woods tree 
that's okay. There's always next time. Maybe. And it's, it's probably best because my phone battery is about to die and I don't have my charger on me today. I actually went to four different stores trying to find what I needed and couldn't. So, also I need some water. Morning, you guys. I'm back out at Camp Champawa. I don't think that's the correct name. I'll put the spelling up on the screen here. It's out in Green Cove Springs, Florida. And I've come back here. It's been about a year since we've, almost a year since we've been out here. Came out here looking for some more trumpet, black trumpet mushrooms. And I didn't think I was gonna find any because the spot I found them last time didn't have anything, but I just stumbled upon a fairly decent little patch here. Things are very easy to miss. I just read an article that said it's like looking for holes in the ground, and it really is. <laughs> These are a bit smaller than the ones I found in the woods near my house. But apparently they like to grow in like soggy soil. Like if the water rises and then falls back down. Um like swamp area, which is kind of what this is. Apparently they really like growing in these kinds of places. Ew, left a booger on me. They were poisonous, or maybe it was something else, but it's a pretty good size. Whoop. Mm -hmm. These actually pop up in our yard every once in a while. These are. They look like oysters. Very buggy. Very buggy. Look at that. And these all must have been oysters, maybe. I don't know. Never found a positively identified an oyster. Look at that. I wish I could see the size of this uh, broadhead skink. He's massive. Probably as long as my foot. He's so big. He's not going to let me get close, but... Hi. Yeah? Here's a blue-tailed skink. 
What? I said what? Help. You said help. Yeah. Oh.